Hello guys, so today what I'm going to show you is how I was able to buy a mod, the Dell 5700 so on stock mode I can only do 52 mega hash per second at stable so right now I was able to make it 56.3 and I think I can still go higher uh, I'm just uh, trying this settings uh, for a while just to make sure this is the stable and then later on I'll try to add little by little the memory clock and see if I can also lower the core clock and maintain this core voltage or do I if I have to go higher or if I can go lower by changing the more power tool to go lower than this but I think I haven't tried this before but I'm happy with 56 with the Dell uh, 5700 so right now here you can see these are 5 uh, 5700 and 15600 XT so these 5 are from Dell as you can see here I bought lots of Dell because right now it's hard to find a graphics card and then there is the 15700 together with other G4 because uh, it it arrived very uh, the next day before this for a uh, graphics card and then this other one is from a previous computer that I bought so now we'll show you how I was able to buy a mod it safely so first just search a uh, red bias editor so once you go there open this one it will go it will bring you on this website and then on the bottom um wait you have to go download an instruction okay and the bottom part uh download red bias editor and flash tool 3.04 so here is the two and then once you open the amd v vb plush you will see these two files so what you're going to do is from the uh, go to this pc open this and then here i created a new folder and then i i rename it to this you can do whatever you want for the folder so for example i opened that and then what i did is i just extracted this files in this folder so now i'll close this so for this i'll show it to you so before doing the mod you need first to um uh, back up the rom the mod uh, the bios i mean so here this will be a tech power app you just have to download it so here once you have this open you just have to select amd and then click this one so save to file and then you can save it here so for the folder whichever you want to use so for example here i save it as 5700 stock.rom and then save and then after that what you will do is open this red bias editor so this one is will show up once you down uh, install this rbe underscore setup which is this red bias editor okay so now what we're going to do is open red bias editor uh, load so go to this pc amd vb plush and then I selected the stock one so here uh, you can put any here so for example if you want to make sure that this is the right one I just put here like mod so that when I do the CMD it will show up that this is the one that will be installed in replace of the old one so now here what we're going to do so go to 1515 megahertz so normally there would be one or two here so for example now oh, for now we're going here 
and then this one I'll go to DRAM timing 12 so what you will do is you have to just multiply this by 2 so you will go uh, here uh, 2945 times 2 5890 5890 and then say ok so now you just have to copy this and then paste it up on those remaining below there so before you go on this one you have to save it first because when, when you go to the other one it won't save this it will just go back to default so first make the custom one so for example 57 mod new test because i already made before so i just made another one to show you uh so now select here go on 1550 again and then re enter 5890 5890 okay now copy paste okay so now save so save it here again all right and now uh, you will uh, install that mod custom mod bios so in order to do that first you have to go type cmd on the windows i'll show it again again cmd okay and then wait so uh, type cd space in a sec uh, go to the folder so here just uh, this will be easier so just open that right click copy and then there i just did the right click which is amazing Wait, i'll just control you know i can't do that so let's do it again there then enter then a and d v v flush i think dash i so that it will show the list oh, i wasn't able to do it anymore so it i think you have to install this again they're installing all right let's see if i can make it work again huh no it's not working to me anymore but i did it before i think i might have to restart again or maybe I'm not sure. Uh, let's try again. If not, probably I need to restart my computer again. CD. Okay. AMD. Flash. Dash I. No, it works okay never mind so zero that's the gpu 5700 so when you're doing this i think it's better to just install one graphics card at a time so at least it will be easier for you to find which one you're trying to uh bias mod okay now so what we're going to do is dash p and then zero and then type in this one so rename and then draw select all copy and then here and then once you enter that it will uh, install this new bias mod so i think it shows here the guide also so here so before you do that you have first to show uh type amd v v plus dash unlock room zero so that it will be unlocked so you can do the bios mod and then here once you do that you will do this one i think dash f will not work we can still try it, type it but it won't work on me but it just worked fine to me without that okay and then after that you have to restart the computer 
and then now you can either use uh Wattman to modify them the settings but i think for me it's easier to use the msi afterburner because with the msi afterburner i can change a setting using the remote chrome rather than the Wattman i think it's hard to open it there might be a way i think you might have to use like a dummy plug so now what you're going to do is here you can try this first and then if this makes you crash all the time try to lower the 